So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna show a 30X Move 4K tracking what we would call like a medium shot. And then we will do a 20X Move 4K camera tracking, which I'll set up now um, as well. So it looks like Mike is getting the 30X camera to start tracking tests. And I'm gonna go ahead and get the 20X camera tracking test. And then we're gonna show them side by side because this is a pretty interesting feature for certain productions where, okay. So Mike's gonna have to go ahead and click in that 30X to get rid of that bounding box. There we go. All right, so now what we're showing is a side-by-side -side view. This is a really nice way to have a completely automated auto tracking situation where you've got head and shoulders tracking of a, of a subject and then you have a more zoomed in shot of someone also tracking. Um, so this is great, right? You could have two PTZ optics move 4K 20Xs or two 30Xs. This is a 30X and a 20X. Mike's showing them nicely there. And the great thing is here is that we can very easily have these cameras. Um, oh, let me get, sorry, I was playing with the zoom, the focus there. There we go. Yeah, so this works in basically any marketing vertical we have here. So Everything. obviously it works great in your presentations, you know, your big events, you have speakers, maybe you want a full body shot. You also want that close up to zoom in. Uh, this could work really well in, in the health industry if you want multiple angles of the doctor or the patient, whoever you'd like. and on and on. It works great in education. You can have a close up to see your professor, your teacher very close, or you could have the full body shot to see her moving around maybe by the whiteboard or the blackboard. So that's pretty cool. And I really, I was really excited about that. Uh, there's the two cameras that we're using here. You can see the tally lights on the top uh, indicating that they are live and part of the production. And uh, this is exactly flawlessly working exactly. I mean, we've been using this and testing this new firmware for quite some time. It has not lost a subject yet. I can confidently say that. It's